Sprout? Who are you? You wanted fire. There you have it. Though I get the sense you two are ill-fit for whatever it is you're plotting. <laughs> this one takes us for a fool, brother. We sons of Ragnar have this well under control. No, we do not. The sons of Ragnar? I know of many. But never have I heard of dull and duller. What is your plan here? We set up that abandoned house to practice a raid. Build it with our most precious things to up the stakes. Even master raiders such as we need to stay sharp, brother. You better hurry. Yes, for glory! Please come with. I do not want to do this with my brother alone. This raid will harden our legacy, brother. Clans will come crawling, begging us to join them. Our names will echo in the halls of Valhalla. Worry not, Spudding Sprout. Together, we will grow you into a fine warrior. I get the feeling we haven't much to teach her. Go on, brother. Like we talked about, blow these doors in like a punishing storm. Stand back, Sprout, and observe. You may learn a thing or two. I am excited. You must hear it in my voice. I cannot do it. Gentle as a lamb. Stand aside. What is wrong? The door is not opening. Use the key. Ah, yes. Uh, uh, where did I put it? God, Mother's axe. It is inside. Please, Strange, you must get it back for us. Find a way in. Dull and duller, like I said. Here. No, no, we said to fight it in the camp. Remember? Who wants to do it? Not me. Wrong again! Focus! In the corner! I seem to remember what <laughs> This must be the key to the door. Get out of there! Thick headed fools! I am unharmed, which makes you very lucky. Smart, you mean? I must have taken Mother's axe out of the house, knowing this fool would forget it. And left the key in its place. You two are as useful as a glass hammer. I'm leaving. Do not listen to that drivel, brother. We must endure. The world will know us by name soon enough. This is not going to end well. Just keep your wits about you. Calm, Ivar. Me and Aver will take care of this. I know. Sigurd, is there a problem? We'll go see Tomna. Just the two of us. Ivar and Uba will wait here. Better if Tomna thinks we've come alone. The truth is, I don't think any of us can stop Ivar from cleaving her head open. It's all he was spewing the whole way over here. Right. Shall we? We'll return shortly. A small fortune for whoever sent Tona to hell. I'll hold you to that. From what I overheard in Repton, the brothers had an arrangement with Tona. What happened? She's a mercenary. Uba used her for men and information. But that relationship soured now that Burgret is all but defeated. From what I heard, 
Tana has hunger for two things. Soft silver and a stern hunt. Neither of which earns you true loyalty. If she can't be trusted, what use is she? That is for us to find out. We may be able to satisfy her. And if we can't? Eva did tell you to bring her axe. I'm here they are, as expected. If she takes a liking to you, keep talking. She's more your type, I think. No, no. This is your chance. Come now. Don't drag your feet. Sigurd, what brings you strolling into my camp this brisk day? I suspect you already know. Yes. The Empress on the air betrayed me. And yet, if you are here talking to me, King Burgeret remains at large. And who are you, lovely dove? Want to perch your ass on my lap? That's not why I'm here. Where is King Burgeret? That is what you want. And what makes you think I have the slightest idea? We found letters. Records of trade. The two of you have a history. What can I say? The king pays well for my services. If only I could say the same for those two Ragnarsson plots. You're dealing with me now. And I want to know what you know. Name your price. Very well. I could use another cow. And you can cover the cost. You take me for a fool. I take you for desperate beggars. I can smell it on you like dung heap. Now that's my price. What say you? You heard me the first time. But I'll get what I need one way or another. No, no. You have shut your chance. And if you show your faces around here once more, I will tear you limb from limb. Well, that is not the result I was hoping for. I hope you have another idea. Tona keeps a close eye on whoever she deals with. If Burgred is keeping records, so is she. Somewhere behind those walls. See what you can find. I'll go back to the brothers. Keep those gates locked. If they come within a foot of you, kill them. came through, just like Trona said they would. I suppose they didn't reach an agreement. Huh. What gave it away?
This longhouse. I should have a look around. Let's keep our wits about us.
This place is heavily guarded. My eyes.
Luna's house. I might find something useful there. Clever. Let's see what secrets you keep, Tuna. This might be something. Looks like Burgred once paid Tona to steer the Ragnarsons away from two areas. Burgred's private hunts, perhaps. He could be at either one. Shouldn't have been so greedy, Tona. Right, back to the brothers. Cautious around here. Eivor, tell us you learned something. Let Estra and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Ledichus is a large village. And Templebroch, it's an old military fort. Not much else. Burkred could be at either one. We should check both as soon as possible. And what do we do with Tona? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Burkred now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Dringir. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me Leatherchester, then. All by my fucking lonesome. Putting a friend, brother. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon.
Good timing. We would have stormed the place without you. What have you seen? Soldiers aplenty. Wagons going in and out. That weasel Borgred is here, I'm sure of it. The bathhouse there, and that church, see? I sent a scout to check them both. Should be back at any moment now. Did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templarbrach? No. And if Burgred is hiding here, I won't have to. There is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. No small tension between you two. Thought you'd be more like-minded. You and Sigurd, you always see eye to eye? More often than not. You are still young. You live to my age and you will see. The closer you get, the greater the stink that rises. Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkrit slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in. The church is well guarded. Might find a way around. to draw attention here. Thank <laughs> you. 
need to get on the other side. they've hidden away. Crates full of food and supplies. Burgret's not giving up without a fight. This must be the bathhouse. We need to find a way inside. I think so too. Our food stores first, lay off its orders. Lay off its orders? <laughs> the king's grown tired of him, you know. That's what all the men are saying. Tired? How do you mean? Are you blind? He questions Burgred's orders every chance he gets. That's from ever since the Danes showed up. Have you lost your mind? I feared you were one of them. Keep quiet. What are you doing here? I'm... I was looking for Burgred. You are Eva's scout. 
I hoped I might find Burgred myself and talk him into surrendering. But he's not in Leatherchester. How can you be sure? Leofrith passed this way with some men. I eavesdropped. It seems they're only stockpiling food here. But he did say something of interest. Gave orders to send more men to Burgred's wife, the Lady Arvilswith. She's in Templebroch. She would know where Burgred's hiding. The sounds of battle. Evi! Let's get you out of here now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. Close to me. What do you want? Fight, man, fight! Are you hurt? Speak up! I... I don't think so. My God. I didn't want it to come to this. It would have killed you, Chilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move! Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our Father, grant me salvation. <laughs> When does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You're reckless, Ivar. Cheobert could have been killed. Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his balls? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Ivar who sent me. I sent myself. Have caution, boy. Until your father is crowned your Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burgred's lady Arthelsweth is in Templebroch. I'm going to find out what she knows.
better be hooded. from that grate. Feels nice. <gasps> Smell nice? Because I just got done pissing in it. <laughs> well, you're an arsehole, you know that? The monster who is soft that get in a flat tonne in the last year. Say that again? You heard me. I need eggs. Viper eggs. Crusty little shits won't go away. This is my land. I was here first. So, as I said, bring me viper eggs, and I'll make sure they leave and never come back. Provoking snakes is not how I plan to spend my day. But that could change. A reward? Yes, I understand your meaning. Bring me the eggs and it will be done. Regret this. <coughs> <laughs> that nearly turned my insides out. Oh, I wish I could see the stir I've caused above. Ugh, my reward before I choked your death. <coughs> As we agreed. Well, have you nothing to say after such a forceful breaking of wind? <coughs> it blew me away. <coughs> <laughs> See me, this will get messy. Oh, God, the smell. 
my god! <laughs> oh, my throat! It's like someone just poured salt! Hold on. We told you everything. Won't you let us go? That depends on what happens here. What do you think? By land or by water? We take a boat in there, it'll cause a stir. Is that a bad thing? Aver, there you are. What's with the prisoners? Man from the fortress, out on patrol. We squeeze them. Burger's not here. It's his queen they're guarding. Others with... They must have separated off the Tomworth. I heard as much from Chaelbert in Lerichester. Chaelbert? What was he doing there? Ivar. Too long a tale for now, but he's fine. I send him to Repton. What's the plan here? It won't be long before someone comes looking for these men. We need to get inside and find Adel's whip. Capture a queen to find a king. It might work. Only one way to find out. See if you can get anything more out of them. Me and Aver will take care of fetching Adel's whip. Oh, then guide you. The Saxons won't welcome us through the front door. We could find a quiet way in, or we can take a long ship. I'm beside you either way. Ah, oh, Hebert. I have dreamt of this day. Of scouring the Shire in search of a king. Of going a vikingur. With you. With our brothers and sisters. Conquering new lands. Forming lasting friendships. And if it takes chasing some weasel across a new land, so be it. I am right where I wish to be. As am I, brother. Must be careful now. Away then.
soldiers' barracks. Others with might be here. You three, scurry. Lady Athelswith, I see Burgred has done his best to hide you away. But what is lost must always be found. Let my handmaidens walk free of this place. They have nothing to do with our quarrel. You hear that, Eivor? Noble. Selfless. This is the sword you must strike a bargain with. A woman of quality. We seek only your king, lady. Tell us where Burgred hides, and we will leave without an ounce of blood spilled. Please, I... I don't... I don't know. Effective, Sigurd. She is only naive to her present danger, but she will soon understand. Wait. Those are the hands of one who washes linens. A servant. She is a decoy. Watch the handmaidens. I'll follow Athels with. Be watchful.
me. My husband will send you all to hell. Quite clever, your ladyship. You're certainly making us work for it. Keep your hands off me, pagan! Have you lost your sense of hospitality? I regret asking. Stay away from me! Let me go! I demand it! After what you put me through, I would have to be mad. Do you understand what you're doing, Pagan? I am the Lady of Mercia. My husband will send you all to hell. You're wasting your time. I won't talk. Not to you, not to any of you barbarians. You may reconsider, if only for your people. For who knows how many more might die at the hands of us barbarians. You don't frighten me. Then you are a fool. Stop what you are doing at once. Put your hands on me. with you have seen better days god will sear your soul heathen if he can find it why the cat chamber sees as much a poet as you where's my kathleen what have you done with her your handmaiden you mean the brave one dressed in royal finery season change with the others i'll take them back to tamworth get them talking if she has so much as a scratch on her I will inform Cheowulf. He might have some ideas on how to get through to her. I will meet you there. Sigurd, what about these prisoners? We've got what we need. Let them go. So kind. Thank you, my friend. She won't talk to me. Eivor will handle it. Go on. You've exhausted my friend Abba here. But I'm wide awake. 
Maybe tell me where Burkett's hiding and let him rest happy. Never. Stone-faced and tight-lipped, all for a king who hides like a cowardly vole. Too scared to protect his family and his people. Thirsty? <laughs> My husband does what he must for Mercia. How could he do otherwise, knowing that even his closest friends could betray him? Give that traitor Cheowulf my message. He may win this earthly battle, but the devil has won the war for his soul. He stabbed you in the back, true. But the people of Mercy are scared, and Cheowulf offers them a balm for that fear. I spit on him. Whatever life he makes in Mercia will be built on the graves of the nobles who gave their lives to defend it. The longer you drag this out, the truer that becomes. We've taken Repton, Tamworth, now Templebroch, and Lerichester. With each victory, your hope for peace recedes. Yet Borgred has what you do not. The loyalty of his people. Good men. Faithful men. Who? The Thanes and Chaos of Mercia? No, no. Only Leofrith remains loyal, and he too will fall. Yes, goodly Leofrith. He will die defending his king. And win or lose, he will send a hundred more of you to hell. Eivor? Your ladyship? Do not mind me. Only here to count my spoils. Oh, God! Out, Eivor. Now. All right, all right. But if you mean to stay, mind the smell after they finish this. My god! Get me out of here! Please! Talk now, and we'll draw you a nice warm bath. You... You are asking me to betray my husband. How can I do that? If you don't, you will betray countless others. In legend, you may be remembered as the king and queen who abandoned their kingdom in its darkest hour. But there will be peace. This is Cheol's promise, and it will be honored. You have my word. Does the caged bird sing? Burgred is hiding in an old crypt to the south, where the Alni and Aero rivers join. A crypt? Now tell me this is not a sign from the gods. It's a long way to carry a king. The three of you must clear a path back to Tamworth. Where can we meet? Bring him to the bridge at Venonus. It's a straight line through. We'll deal with any trouble there. How many more times will I have to curtail your spectacles, Ivar? Spectacle? That's just me. Whoever trains these Mercian soldiers should be relieved of their duty, I think. yourself. Eivor. Come. Stand here and look out over the fjords. Hold my hand. There you go. <gasps> I've never been so high. <laughs> Your father brought me here long ago when we were just 19 winters. Together we stacked stones into cairns. These? Yes. Think of this as a test of mind and wit. Stack the cairn stones high and wide into any shape you like. How do I win? You win by playing. And a quiet mind is your reward. Let the air and nature's beauty soothe you.
of night. I will enter the camp alone. We will not leave you, Editha, no matter the danger, no matter the risks. We do this together or not at all. Don't you know it's forbidden to consort like this under God's roof? Take what you want, heathen. Just leave us be. You must be the abbess here. Why do you hide in a musky old church? We are not hiding. We sought to flee the Shire in the midst of this ungodly war. But in our haste to leave, I lost my crozier, fell into the hands of some guards in a camp just below. And I am not leaving without it. Dangerous endeavor for three sisters of the cloth. What is your plan? You're gonna bore them with Bible passages until they give it back? Do not be afraid or discouraged, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. <laughs> it just may work. Or better yet, I can get your crosshair back. You would help us? Merchant soldiers make good practice. And now I'm invested in your plight. Lead the way.